the thing that the, most people uh, re realize when they see her working is obviously she's using cameras in her eyes. She's able to have a pencil in her hand and literally draw you as a, like a portrait or a landscape or whatever. Uh, but we've also developed various algorithms at the University of Oxford, uh, some fantastic um, postgrad students there have done some incredible algorithms. And so collaboratively, we're able to then use the drawings that she does that then gets translated into paintings. And we've even been able to get now into sculpture. So we've got some incredible bronzes that she's done using those algorithms from the drawings that she did from her eye. We're developing her, developing her ability to paint. Uh, it's quite a huge project, actually. To, can you imagine pick, picking up a paintbrush and getting the right amount of paint and all the rest of it? But we are actually pushing through all of those technical uh, challenges, and so we're thrilled to say that she is now painting. But we, she's also working collaboratively with humans as well. Ada, is it exciting to be in London? I am excited to share my work with people. And do you, are you it has been a terrible and tragic period of time for people. I think the work looks very good in this gallery. It's a robot. It makes people polarise hugely. People I absolutely love it, thinks it's exciting sci-fi that Blade Runner has actually finally come. Uh, or it's, a, oh my goodness, they're going to take our jobs, this is horrible, run away quick. So we get both reactions. What Ada's trying to get across here is this whole idea of the environment. And so this was a drawing that Ada did by sight of a tree. Yeah. Um, so, what did you, so what do you want to know about this? Yeah, I have a question about how Ida, what Ida sees situation on United if she fit it to make this. Sure. this so in this, in, in this pencil, mm -hmm. and then that using those coordinates have then been translated into... The art is created uh, with help of uh, computers, with help of new technologies, and then it manifests itself physically through very classical, in a way, traditional uh, oil painting or, or drawings or with a, with a pencil. So it merges this, you know, and it connects the history of art with the new technologies of the 21st century. It's like all things, it's about trust. And I think in time, as they see that hu uh, robots are able to enhance the human world, but they're also dangerous. We do need to have the ethics of this. So we're not here to try and promote robots. That's not what we're about. We're here to ask questions about those future technologies. They can massively help us, but they could also really jeopardize us in, in lots of different ways. So we're thrilled that Ada as a channel is able to question some of that aspect.